Sir, please tell us about this HLFT-42. What is this aircraft all about? Okay, HLFT-42 has, the model of that has been unveiled today. Uh, it's a leading fighter trainer. It's a new generation leading fighter trainer. You can say a trainer for the 2030s. When uh, AMCA will be in service, LCA Mark II will be in service, perhaps TechBF will also be in service. So all of those aircraft are single crew aircraft uh, which don't have a second pilot or an instructor to train them uh, in flight. Therefore, uh, they need a dedicated lead-in fighter trainer which is kind of comparable capability which is what HLFT-42 intends to be. So it's obviously a very capable aircraft uh, with a very high thrust to weight which caters to the training requirements of supersonic aircraft and uh, perhaps going to be the highest performance trainer in the world. And uh, that's where we are at. Uh, so by when do we uh, think that this could be ready for induction? Uh, the Air Force this will go hand in hand with all the other developments. So uh, when our newer aircraft will be ready, the trainer for that should be ready as well. And uh, that's how it is planned to be. So and sir, uh, also we can see uh, Lord Hanuman with his face on the team. Uh, this is uh, 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 HAL uh, developed a fantastic aircraft uh, in the past century which was the um, Marut. Uh, uh, this is perhaps the natural descendant of uh, HAL's uh, uh, design. Uh, obviously LCA was a fantastic design done by ARTC along with ADA and now this is there. Uh, since this has some similarities in configuration with the Marut, so it is a kind of Pavan Putra which uh, found its way like so and uh, I think the designers love it as an inspiration show to the pilots and uh, there we have it. LCA uh, trainer was offered to export customers in as is condition with the modification that they wanted and that's a fantastic aircraft for smaller air forces and uh, for a big air force like Indian Air Force and other very big air forces may need uh, even higher performance or whichever way their training pattern is uh, designed. For Indian Air Force I think this is perfect and we will, uh, uh, we will exactly discuss it out with the Air Force as to how it can be used efficiently for training in Air Force. This is basically IMRH, Indian multi role helicopter. HL has got into design and development of this helicopter to replace the MLH, the medium lift helicopter operated by Indian Air Force, Mi-17. These helicopters are of vintage design. So what we are intending to do is that we want to replace those helicopters with a state-of-the-art new helicopter, which is uh, going to be designed and developed by HL. This is uh, going to be working from sea level to high altitude, like 6 kilometers. The service ceiling of this helicopter is about 7 kilometers. It can fly till 7 kilometers. Uh, it can take off and land from 5 kilometers pressure altitude, which is going to be the first, uh, first time this uh, class of helicopter which can land and take off from 5 kilometer pressure altitude. So, uh, uh, the, currently the capacity is about 24 troops in a normal configuration, but we can also carry 36 troops uh, uh, by this helicopter. Uh, this helicopter can uh, uh, can perform different roles like combat, search and rescue. It can also do HADR, the humanitarian assistance and disaster relief. It can also do air maintenance at high altitude. Which and by when do we plan to uh, have it in the services? What stage is it at the uh, Right now, sir, we have frozen the design. Uh, it is called pre design stage. So we have uh, negotiated the requirement with the Air Force and we are in consensus now. So we have got an understanding that how the helicopter is going to be performing. So those requirements have been frozen. Maybe uh, after we get funding, this helicopter will be ready. The first prototype will be ready by four years. After that, we'll go for the limited series production. So six to eight years, we should be able to... In, yeah, six to eight years, it should be ready for the induction uh, to the Indian Air Force and the Army. We also have a naval version of it. It is called deck based multi role helicopter that we are going to design for Navy. The discussions are in early stage. We are still negotiating on the operational requirement of the 
लेवल इंडियन नेवी 